What's up? It's Dam Noah here at Dam Studio, and today I'm going to show you guys how to get a nice grungy texture for your screen printed designs. So that's getting a nice grungy texture onto each color separated layer, so you can send that off to the print shop, and when they print out those shirts for you, it's going to come out with that nice grungy texture, that worn effect that you want. And basically to achieve this, it's actually pretty simple. So I'm going to go over to my design here. It's separated into three different colored layers. So I got my bottom layer, I've got my middle layer, I've got my top white layer, the three together. Uh, so this would be suitable for three color screen print. So what we're going to do to grunge this up and texture this up is I'm going to go into my folder here. I'm going to grab this vintage sparse grunge and I'm going to resize this and I'm just going to drag it down just a little bit just so we get more of the grunge in the center of that design there. And then we're going to go down and we're going to hit create clipping mask and linear burn. So this is just going to make sure that it's not applied to the background, it's just applying to the design. And as you can see, it's burning right through the design. So basically just adding black values into the rest of the design here. So this is where the trick is. So what you're going to do is you're going to keep this layer highlighted. You're going to go up to your magic wand tool and you're going to make sure the tolerance is really high and you're going to zoom in. And with the magic wand tool selected, you're going to select those grungy little textures in there and we can zoom out here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down to my individual colored layers and I'm just going to hit delete all the way down. What basically happened is when I turn on my background here, you can see it applied those grungy textures to each individual layer without me even having or needing to have this grungy texture over top on. So now when you go to send this off to the shop for screen print, you basically just have your one layer here, you go up to file, you go to export, you would export as, and you just go down to PNG. And you would just do this same thing, you'd export this out individually for each layer. And yeah, if you wanted to texture this up even more, you could do the same with literally any other texture, just dragging that over top, selecting the black values with the magic wand, and deleting them for every single layer going down. But yeah, guys, that's how you achieve that grungy kind of texture for your screen printed designs. Let me know what you guys think in the comments and like and subscribe if you learned something. Okay, peace out.